everyone, this is Jordan from SleekLens.com and in this video I'm going to show you the new reference view in Adobe Lightroom CC. So, so the reference view is basically just a simple and easy way to reference a previously edited photo so you can edit a new photo in that same kind of style. And so for example, here is a photo that is edited uh, and it's uh, it, it was a picture of a kitchen and you can see that it's, it looks really nice and clean. And so I have this photo right here and I want it to kind of look the same way. This one has a lot of uh, white balance issues and I want it to kind of match the editing style of the other other one. So normally I would have to try to copy the development settings, paste them over and try to go back and forth and try to see if it matches it. But in the new reference view you're able to reference a previously photo side by side. And so the way you do this is you go to the photo that you want to edit. This is the photo that I want to try to match up. And so I'm going to click on this photo here and I'm going to click on the reference view and this, it's the little RA button and that stands for reference and active. So this is the active photo that we're going to edit and now it just says drag and drop a photo photo from the film strip to set as your reference photo. So now I go down here to the film strip and I find my reference photo and all I do is drag, click and drag it up there and now I have this photo. This photo is going to stay here and I can just look at the, I can reference this photo right here and concentrate on editing this photo. And so the way I'm going to do this one really quickly is just pay with, play with the white balance here, maybe bump up the exposure, take down the highlights a little bit. Uh, there's still a little bit of yellow in here so I'm going to kind of go in here and remove a little bit of the yellow. Uh, there's still a lot of blue as well. Do the same thing there. Uh, maybe to bump up the contrast and maybe more exposure. And you can kind of see what I'm doing here. I'm just kind of looking over side by side and seeing how this one matches up with this one. For the most part, it looks pretty good. So I'm going to stick with that one. And now I'm done. I've referenced the photo. They both look pretty similar. And now to go back to my regular uh, editing view, I just click the loop view button right here. And it takes me back to my uh, normal full size photo. So now that that's all I need to do. If I ever want to uh, reference a, a, a separate photo that I've edited, that's all I got to do is go down to the reference and active view. If I want to go to another photo and reference a different kind of style, all I got to do is click and drag that up and it will replace that photo. And I can start editing a different photo. So you can see how, how important that could be, especially if you want to try to mimic a whole bunch of styles uh, at once and you don't have to go flip back and forth between different photos to try to find that style. All right, guys, hope you enjoyed that quick little tutorial on the reference view in Adobe Lightroom CC. This is Jordan from sleeklens.com and I'll see you in the next video.